Hey, 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 Talk Monsters, what's going on? It is, uh, what is, oh my gosh, it's Saturday night. Saturday night in the Chalk Monster Boutique. How are you guys? My name is Kathy. I'm a mentor chocator, and I'm excited to chalk it up. Oh my gosh, I have my ears on backwards. How embarrassing. Let's flip those around. I am excited and ready to chalk it up with you guys tonight. Are you ready to chalk it up with me? As you're coming on, let me know you're here. Say hello. I would love to welcome you. You guys, we are going to do some fun chalk tour projects tonight. If you have never heard of Chalk Couture, oh my gosh, you guys are in for a treat. We are the hottest new trend in DIY home decor. And I'm gonna show you some jack-o'-lantern fun tonight. It is Halloween week in the Chalk Monster Boutique. You guys, we have the coolest subscription program. This is called Club Couture. This is our August transfer. If you join in August, you can add this transfer to your subscription. May the road rise up and meet you. The club is only $19.99 a month, $26.99 in Canada. You get an eight and a half by 11 inch size transfer, three packets of paste. And if you are a club member in August, you get free shipping on every order the entire month of August. And oh my gosh, you guys, the, the, this is the transfer for September. So join today so you get fall blessings. I just got mine today. Is it beautiful? We're going to be making this next week. All right. So get yours so you can make yours along with me. If you join my club, you get a free mini starter kit when you join and you also get a discount off of all regularly priced products. So join my club. Click the, um, the link actually, um, let me see if I can put it in the comments below and then you can find it. How about that? Also, you guys, if you think this looks amazing and you want to start your own business, you guys, this is the perfect time to do it with so many people at home watching YouTube, watching, um, let me turn this down. I don't want to hear myself talk. Um, yeah, so if you want to start your business um, from home, this is the perfect time to do it. I am telling you. Um, so many people are um, watching YouTube, they're watching Facebook, and this is, um, there we go, absolute time to get in and get your business started. I'm telling you. Um, there we go. Got it pinned. Okay. So let's get back to the music. Okay. Um, so if you want to get your business started, you guys, this is our business in a box for only $99. You get everything you see here, $250 worth of product. Okay. Five jars of paste, seven transfers, three surfaces, a chocolate tour apron, designer startup guide, catalog, 12 thank you notes and a squeegee, everything you need. And then you get 40% off all products going forward. So get your business started today. You guys, we have the most amazing new team opportunity group where you can watch a video, um, learn more information and win some free products and even a Visa gift card. So if you want more information about joining, just type hashtag info or click, um, if you see in the comments there, click the um, for all my links and that will get you some more information as well. Okay. All right. How about if we get started tonight, we are show you guys. So these are some pumpkin cutouts that I did last year. I'm going to take the chalk paste off of these. Okay. I chalked both sides, right? And we're going to use the new jack-o'-lantern transfer it's got pumpkins it's got jack-o'-lanterns and we're going to do this one um, on monday night okay on a different surface so before i get started let's i'm going to set the my transfer down here okay we're going to see um i'm going to do kind of a little experiment our um spray some water on these okay our pumpkins are supposed to be 
single use only. I wax mine. I'm gonna see if I can reuse them, okay? Now I'm looking for my paste scraper over here. This handy tool will come in handy when we're trying to do this, and so will my board eraser, okay? I'm gonna show you both of these. So let's go to project view. So you guys can see what I'm doing. Okay, there we go. Okay, sometimes you're just not sure which tool will work better. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is taking it off completely. I love it. And even though, even if there's a little bit of ghosting, I'm gonna try some wax on it, see if that takes it off. Um, and even if it doesn't, I think that will be okay because the transfer we're using, I think will cover the entire pumpkin. Aren't these cutouts adorable? These came back in the fall and winter catalog this year, you guys. I have several sets if you're local. If you're not, no worries. You can order them online on my chalk site. It is www.chalkcouture.com slash chalk monster boutique okay and if you see in the comments um, i pinned it at the top there is a link to all of my links so that's where you can find my website club couture link um, youtube instagram my vip group everything and you guys if you're not in my vip group you are missing out that is where i offer all my sales and my discounts and bundles all the steals and deals. So if you're not in my VIP group, click on that link tree link where, um, link where it says Chalk Monster Boutique. You'll find the link to join or just type hashtag VIP and I will send you the link. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, right? Okay, I can't believe how well, how easy this is coming off. Look at that. Our paste, um, I made these a year ago with our paste, and our paste is water soluble, obviously, because look at that. Okay, just a little bit more right there, right? Okay. Now what I'm going to do, yeah, um, the other reason I think it came off so easily is because I um, used some wax on them. So let's get, let's do that again. Okay. Let me see if I can adjust this down just a little bit. There we go. That's better. Okay, so I'm, I'm using, um, this is Men Wax Finishing Paste. Chalk Couture just came out with some new wax, and I've got it on order. Um, it is supposed to work just as well, if not better, than Men Wax, and I hear it doesn't smell. This Men Wax has a strong odor to it, for sure, okay? So if the odor of, odor of the min wax bothers you, I would definitely try try the Chalk Couture min wax or the Chalk Couture wax. You can find that on my chalk site as well. www.chalkcouture.com slash Chalk Monster Boutique or just click that um, Click that link that I pinned in the comments, okay? That'll take you anywhere you need to go. Okay, so you can see there's still some paste left in here on this one. It like got into the grooves. I could sand it off if I really cared that much, but I, I'm going to chop over it, so I think it's going to be okay. We're going to find out. 
And what's cool about our chalk paste, if I don't like it, I can wipe it off and redo it. Now, if you guys are using ink, like on um, fabric, you cannot do that. You can't just wipe it off because ink is permanent, especially once it's heat set, right? Okay. So now let's get our transfer out. This one is a huge transfer. It is an E size, so we're gonna need to cut it apart. Which is fine and dandy. That's what it's designed for, right? Hello, Jamie, how are you? What's going on, Jamie, how are you? Okay. So let's cut this baby apart. It's going to be easier to use if we do that. Okay. Well, it comes with these two. You guys, we also have pumpkin patterns. That, is, that are in a set of four. Like one's a vine and one's an argyle design for the big one, and then one's a striped and a polka dot for the little one. They're called pumpkin patterns. They're on my chalk site too, and they are, um, again, like designed and perfectly fit these pumpkin cutouts. And I used those on last night's live if you want to go back and check them out. Okay. You guys can try to cut on the cut lines, but if you if you don't, that's okay. Okay, there we go. Now, like I said, we're gonna save this one for tomorrow night, and we're gonna do it on a different board. So I'm gonna put it back here next to my Halloween candy. Now, I'm gonna set these right there because we're gonna use those next. And you guys know, I always tell you right on the back of your transfer what it is. So I'm gonna write big pumpkin. And I'll write small pumpkin on this one. Okay. We do that because um, our transfers are reusable over and over again, 10 to 12 times, okay? So when you um, are finished with it, you're just gonna wash it with plain water, okay? I like to use one of our board erasers and just wipe it off, okay? Then I put it, um, I turn it over, sticky side up, and lay it flat to dry. And I lay it on one of our um, fuzzing cloths on the microfiber side. And I let mine dry overnight. And then in the morning, I come back and put them back on their backer sheets. And then I store them that way and put them, um, put them back in the, um, what do you call it? Back in the plastic wrap. Okay. So. Just making sure I got this perfectly on my pumpkin. Looks like it's just a tiny bit bigger, so let me make sure I got it. Fit just right. It doesn't have to be perfect. Okay, that should work. It's like I've got a bubble in it or something. Okay. 
There we go. So there's not a lot of places for the transfer to stick to, because so it's, it's being kind of tricky on me. Okay, so now let's get our paste out. Um, I think I'm going to do, I could do orange peel. What would be some other pretty colors? But you know what, we've got some really, you know what I'm gonna do? This is our new camel. Wouldn't a camel be pretty? I am digging camel. And then I wonder if I have, let me see if I have a good dark green. That would be perfect with it. If not, what do you guys think? Do you have any suggestions? The orange peel would be good. I don't know if I have a really good dark green. Okay, I think we'll do, yeah, we'll do the big one in camel and the little one in orange peel. All right. This is a brand new paste and a brand new color for fall. Look how pretty that is. All right, let me get squeegee and stir stick. There we go. Just get all this goodness off the lid. What are you guys doing tonight? Anyone doing anything fun and exciting? It is Saturday night after all. Hey Peyton, how are you? Welcome to the Chalk Monster Boutique. All right, so I'm just giving this a good stir, okay? It's a perfect consistency. This is beautiful. And then I just put it down with my star stick just like this. Let's see if I can straighten up my transfer again. It is just not wanting, it's not wanting to stick to the pumpkin because I got so much wax on it. Maybe I can get it to stick like that to the edges. That would be good. All right, you guys, I think that's the ticket. Because we don't want any bubbles in it. There you go, that's what you want to do. You want to stick it to the edges so you don't have any bubbles. this is gonna work. I'm gonna use my big squeegee for this. Ah! I don't know what that was. Sure made me jump though. All right you guys there are some bubbles air bubbles in this so Let's see how this turns out. Air bubbles are not a good thing. We're gonna see, okay? So all of the excess goes back into the jar. Squeegee it off. Trying to work my way 
through these air bubbles. I don't know, that, that part of the pumpkin may not be pretty because we've got some bubbles in there. So we'll see. If it's not pretty, it's okay, I'll show you how we'll fix it. Okay. Now, let's see what we got. Okay, that's not too bad. I am kind of liking it. I am, I am. All right, I'm gonna dry it and then I'm gonna do the stem. Okay, this can work. This can work, you guys. We just need it a little bit down here. And I think it's gonna work. I'm digging it. Digging it. Hot diggity dog. What do you guys think? How about some hearts? How about some love? Hit this with the hair dryer. Get it good and dry. save the jack-o-lantern faces for Monday night because I want my um, paste to be super good and dry before I put the jack-o-lantern faces on there. So we may, we may make that part two for Monday night. So Monday night, I think we'll do part two of the jack-o-lantern faces and then we'll do, we'll also do this one, okay? We'll do the other half of this transfer. How's that sound, you guys? Will you come back Monday, what, Monday night for part two? Awesome. All right. There is my hair dryer. Okay, so Monday night, we will come back and we will do the jack-o'-lantern faces on here, okay? And I'll also, I wanna do the stem a different color. I wanna do it in green. So we'll do the stem. Monday night, part two. So let me put that pumpkin right there. All right, now let's do this one. Okay, a sip of water. Hello, Karen. How are you? What are you doing tonight, Karen? All right, so here is our small pumpkin. And we're just gonna put transfer on. Just like this. Okay. So again, there's nothing for it to stick to on the wood cutout, right? Because it's like all silk screen. So what we're gonna try to have to do, what we're gonna have to try to do is what I'm going to say, is stick it to the edges. So it has some silk screen. Okay. So try not to get any bubbles. This is tricky, you guys. There's just nothing, right? This is all silk screen, so there's nothing for the transfer to stick to. We're gonna have to try this um, transfer on another surface. It would be much easier. This one's really tricky. It's not impossible. It's just tricky. And our other one came out fine, so I'm sure this one will too. Okay, let's see how that goes. All right, this is our orange peel. So we are going to 
give it a good stir. It is perfect consistency. Okay. Again, trying to make sure we don't have any bubbles. I'm going to spread this paste around. You know, I think it would be really cute to do purple and green pumpkins. I just think like dark purple is perfect for Halloween, you know? Hey Peggy, what's going on? Welcome to the boutique, Peggy. Hey Donna, welcome to the boutique, my friend. How are you? There we go. Now. Let's do just gonna do that one. That stem right there in the camel. Okay. Now we're gonna squeegee this off. And remember all of our excess paste goes back into the jar. So there is no waste. Hey Trina, how are you my friend? What's going on? How's your Saturday night going? Okay. Now, let's peel it off and see how we did. Oh, this is cute, you guys. Look at that cute little pumpkin. Okay, that is adorable. I'm pretty happy with it. What do you guys think? Do you like my pumpkins? How about some hearts? How about some love? How about some thumbs up? All right, you guys, so what we're gonna do tomorrow night is we're gonna let these um, completely dry overnight. And then we're gonna put some faces on them um, on Monday night, I mean, okay? So we'll do part two on Monday night. We'll put faces on them, and then we're gonna make this sign, jack-o'-lanterns shining bright. And we'll display, the sign will go with our jack-o'-lanterns. Won't that be cute? I'll show you how you can display them all together because they're made to go together. So what do you guys think? How about some hearts? How about some love? How about some thumbs up? Do you love my pumpkins? I think they are amazing. I appreciate you guys joining me tonight. Come back and see me on a Monday night and we'll do part two, okay? You guys are awesome. Have a great night, great weekend, great Sunday, and I will see you on Monday night. Bye, guys.